my name's Neve. I'm the dementia coordinator with Good Neighbours. So our project is a sort of spin-off from the general Good Neighbours project, but we focus on helping people who have had um, early stages of diagnosis of dementia and Alzheimer's and we help to reduce isolation and loneliness by getting some befriending going and supporting them and getting out into the local community. Good Neighbours is a project that runs, we try and eliminate loneliness and isolation. A lot of our mission is to just get in there and reduce some of that isolation by doing some befriending work. It might be helping people go to a group or get out in their community or it could also be like a one-off task like prescriptions food shopping, things like that, so it's quite a mixed bag of what we do, but I'd say behind a lot of it we're just trying to help people get connected to each other, reduce that isolation around Warrington and just help people feel a little bit better. Uh, the project is aimed at getting people out of their houses and just going for a short little walk. Um, we found that people really need a reason to get out and about and this is ideal for uh, just increasing mobility, increasing sociability and um, giving people something to look forward to and join in with. Kath, uh, who lived locally, who's had two hip replacements and I think both knees done, <laughs> who first came um, and we only went round this block um, and she, would, she had two sticks and she walked like this and she now walked one stick. one stick and we go all round Orford Park. Got the, the list through from Michelle, um, came, rang on the doorbell, um, yeah. and that was my first introduction to Derek. Uh, yeah. So I brought the shopping in, and sat, we sat and had a chat, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Yeah, so, yeah. Um, and I said to Derek I'd be coming each week to do the shopping. I think we do three shops um, when they come out, and we sat and had a chat, and I enjoyed chatting with Derek, and I, I think Derek kind of enjoys chatting with me. Well, I'll talk to anybody because it's <laughs> no, no disrespect. No, I, I know, Derek, I know. <laughs> he always seems to come in at the right time. If they're all as good as Steve, well, I'll be quite satisfied. Well, I'm quite satisfied, whatever. But a bit of company, Derek, for yeah. you every now and again and a good chat. Yeah. Oh, we've always got plenty to talk to, haven't we? We, we have. We yeah. have. The beneficiary hadn't seen anybody all week her family lives down south her the daughter would come up every weekend to see the see the mum but obviously monday to friday that's a long time to be on your own so one of my volunteers went in we did a couple of weeks of befriending and every week i was getting emails saying the volunteer took the beneficiary spring flowers and they had a laugh and they watched tv together and the whole family was feeling back that it was really making a difference in her personality and that she came alive a little bit more at the weekends after she'd had that bit of interaction so from the dementia side i'd say small but mighty. But I really look forward to seeing people because I've been a people person um, all my life I suppose uh, and that was something I missed. I've never watched so much television in all my life and it's great to have an excuse to switch it off because I start off the day in this chair. Right when I first come I was thinking oh I'm nervous what will I talk about? And I don't remember it being awkward in the slightest. Nope, it was the slightest. no, it was just hi, I'm Lindsay, oh. and then it's you just talk about your family, your pets, and then you go on to other stuff, holidays, and you tell me about where you used to live and what you used to do. And it's amazing the history that you can get out of people walking around. I just love talking to people um, and finding out what their life was like, you know, because we've all had a, a long life, most of us, at our age that are walking doing the walks and um, it's very interesting, I just found it interesting and I still feel like I want to put something back into the community if I can, simple really. So I'd say the Good News Project for me is about connecting pockets of people that might never normally get together and helping to build friendships along the way. The Good Neighbours scheme to me is being supportive. You just see the person evolve from being lonely to coming out of the shed. Yes, the, well, the Good Neighbour Scheme to me is companionship. Just do a little bit for the community, I think, is extremely useful. It's rather than be as good as Steve. <laughs> yeah. I think they all are.